to Puzzle Master. This is the puzzle guy and in this video I will show you how to solve Subway puzzle. This puzzle was designed by Akaki Kumeri from Japan and it is a part of Akaki's Picnic Basket series. All puzzles from the basket series were 3D printed using a biodegradable PLA. The basket was printed using a, some kind of a wood PLA since it looks a little bit like a wooden basket. The subway puzzle has a difficulty level 9 out of 10 on a Puzzle Master's difficulty scale that runs from 5 to 10. And the object of the puzzle is to remove all parts from the basket and then put them back inside the basket. This puzzle has three parts and what's make it a little bit more challenging is that you don't know the shape of the parts. You don't know how they look and, and what to expect from this puzzle. But at a first glance it may seem like there is a lot of space here, you can easily remove it remove all parts and when you try to remove one of the pieces you will quickly figure out that you can probably do a couple of moves but then you are stuck and don't know what to do next and all puzzles from the Akaki's picnic basket have a unique uh, moves that uh, will help you to solve the puzzle if you like the subway puzzle and you want to buy it go to puzzlemaster.ca and if you want to see the solution of this puzzle keep watching the video and now I will show you how to solve the subway puzzle. Obviously, we're gonna start with the biggest piece that is on top, this one. And as you can see, you can do just a couple of moves with this piece. But there is another move that you can do and it is a rotation. When the piece is right here, you can rotate it and remove. That was so simple. <laughs> but you probably didn't know that there is a rotation here. Now we have two parts left and this part even more challenging than the remo removing of the first piece. You have to move two parts up and they are uh, moving together since they are interlocked. Now we have to move this piece one step towards this direction. Then the first step, uh, piece will go all the way down and now we have to deal with this piece and you can move it and rotate it different directions but you still can't remove it from the basket since there is another kind of a rotation involved here so what you have to do is move the piece here rotate it like this and then do this kind of rotation and remove the piece that was unique and then the last piece is quite easy to remove from the frame to put everything back just feed the first piece inside then grab this piece put it inside like this, rotate, then rotate it again and put right here. Now you have to move the first piece all the way up. Probably it is much easier to do when you're flipping the basket upside down. Let's do it like this. Hey, go up. Now when this piece is up, you can move this piece inside this cutout of the first piece and both parts will go down and we have only one part left which we have to put inside like this rotate it and put it inside the basket that was the solution of the subway puzzle as i told you at the beginning that this puzzle has some quite unique moves uh, as you as you saw there were at least two interesting rotations uh, that helped me to figure out the way how to solve the puzzle. If you like the subway puzzle or you want to try some other amazing puzzles from the Akaki's Picnic Basket series, go to puzzlemaster.ca. See you next time.